Here's the truth about male-female relationships. Women are physically attracted to men they respect. That's it, they are not attracted to men they like. They are not attracted to men they love. They are attracted to men they respect. If she loves you and likes you and doesn't respect you, she will not get physical with you. So if they respect you they're going to sleep with you and this is something that's biological and evolutionary. So how do you make women respect you? Well first you have to be worthy of respect as an individual. There's no hack if you're worthy of respect then you are worthy of respect. But secondly, you cannot allow blatant disrespect. So if you allow her to blatantly disrespect you, and you tolerate that, then you're setting a precedent which means, well why would I respect this guy in the first place? I've had loads of friends who come to me and they say, you know my woman doesn't respect me. And I say look it's much harder to fix something that's broken, just never let it go wrong in the first place. So from the second you got together you should have been a man and you can be. You haven't got to be a jerk, you'll not be aggressive. You will sit with a girl and very politely say look if we're going to be in a relationship, if I'm going to take you seriously, you're not going to have male friends. If you want to hang around with a whole bunch of men then I'm not going to take you seriously. I'm never going to look at you as serious wife material. And now the decision is on you. Now they choose to keep all their male friends. Then that means she's chosen these friendships over me. Which means sooner or later she was going to cheat anyway. Like how long until she jumps on a new guy anyway. So why would I even be upset about it? But most men are too scared to just put the ultimatum down and not you haven't put the ultimatum down in some scary big brash way just be clear. So yeah it's your choice and this is the point. But most men don't say anything. They let it slide and they let it get completely broken and they come to me and say well how do I fix it? It's like you have to make it not let it get broken in the first place. You need to understand your boundaries and expectations as a man and you have to set them and you have to make sure she complies and sticks to them. And if she doesn't, you're gonna have to find somebody else. If you want to be happily married the best thing you can be first is a playboy, because you're gonna learn a whole bunch about women. You're gonna have a whole bunch of choices to choose for a wife. If you're stuck with one option the one chick you met she might be a bad match for you. So like being a playboy is important. But yeah absolutely for setting your boundaries and stuff and making sure you're not disrespected. This is the bottom line. Most men are not prepared to walk away. And if you're not prepared to walk away then you don't have any weapons. If she knows no matter what you won't leave then what weapons do you have? Anything you say. Shouting. Screaming. Yelling. Going away for a few days or whatever. She knows you're going to come back. So this is the point. So as a man if you're never prepared to walk away you're never going to be respected and the woman thinking you know what he might just leave me is linked. You have to let her know look there are some things I won't tolerate. And if you mess with me I'm gonna walk away. And if you walk away and she doesn't chase you then she's gone at least you saved yourself a nasty divorce and getting cheated on and all that stuff. Just end it then and there and save yourself a bunch of time. But men are too afraid to pull the plug on it because they get addicted to the girl and they don't believe they can get any other girls. And they get all messed up and this is one of the advantages of being a playboy. You can leave any chick because you got 10 more. So if she doesn't act right, just replace her. You would go through the breakup for a week and it's just like this is part of the game. So you have to look at any relationship you're in and say okay I'm a nice guy I love her she loves me but I have boundaries and if she doesn't respect them, I'm gonna have to walk away. And that's the truth otherwise you're never gonna be respected.